Hi friends, thanks for joining me for today's encouragement video. One of the parts of my job is I get to plan these worship nights for our church. And I don't know if you plan creative events or projects, but sometimes I get these mental blocks and I don't know what to do. Like I have this vague idea of what to do, but I can't write out the plan. Well, look behind me. Here, this is kind of an insight into my work life. I love to whiteboard. And so I whiteboarded out this whole plan, but it didn't start that way. I didn't get this awesome plan for a worship night just out of the wind, out of pulled it out of the air. I was stuck. So here's what I did. Field trip with me. Come on. I walked out of my office. And as I was walking out of my office, I started to come down this hallway. And I started thinking of these Bible verses. Well, where two or three are gathered, there I will be. That's what Jesus said. So I gotta go find two or three people. Think about this, James 5. It says, the prayer of a righteous man is powerful and effective. Okay, let's go find some righteous men. And then I thought, well, what did the early church do? Well, you think about early church, Acts 1. They met together, they prayed together in Jesus' name. Now, we're entering the other side of the offices, so uh, keep coming with me because this is where I walked. I walked all the way through here. Yeah, it was a journey, but I made it to this back office where a couple of my buddies were. And in here, and they're here today, I have Pastor Luke, Pastor Tom, and I sat down and I said, guys, I need you to pray for me. And they did. Two or three were here. They started praying for me. A few minutes later, I said, thank you for the prayer. Walked back to my office. Boom. It just started coming to me. Oh, we should do this, and we should do this, and we should do this. God was breaking through because other people were praying on behalf of me. So I don't know if you're stuck today, but my encouragement for you is to go find some people. It takes a little bit of humility and let them pray for you and encourage you. So God, I pray for uh, my friends that they would have uh, people in their lives that they would be humble enough to ask them, hey, would you pray for me? and that they would see how powerful it is to have friends like that interceding for you. I pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. All right, go on a journey. Find your friends.